Northern Lights Ranch. I'm so happy to be here. You guys have no idea. This has been like a bucket list place for us for years and years and years. So it's so cool to finally be here. We've been like vlogging our whole trip in Finland, but I wanted to do just one day here because there's so much fun to like there's so many fun things to do. So this morning we went and we had a breakfast, like a cozy little buffet. And the best part about the breakfast is that they have like all these windows facing out to the pasture with all these baby reindeer. So while you're eating breakfast, you're just seeing the reindeer. And that was definitely the highlight for me. So, so fun. going to give you guys a quick tour of our cabin. Here's our very cozy little cabin. Oh my goodness, look at all the snow, so pretty. And just look at these views, so magical. Oh my gosh, it's better than I could have ever expected or hoped for. And then this is what they look from the outside. I'll show you on the other side, but let's see inside. You go right through here. Right when you walk in, we have our cozy closet for all of our suitcases and sweaters and stuff and then we have a bathroom right here all the floors are heated which is so so nice everything is just styled so nicely so hello and to look here there's another little window right to the outdoors so we have a little bit of natural light and then the real star of the show is this room oh my Gosh, I just cannot get over it. I keep telling Joey like I can't believe we're here, but look at these views. Like imagine waking up to this. It's such a dream. <laughs> we spent some time this morning just like reading and snuggling and it was just oh so so nice. So beautiful. The ceiling as well is also all glass and the glass is like heated so that when it snows it just melts right off. We have our little table corner here, a little coffee bar which is a bit messy right now because this is where we're charging everything. Everything dies so fast because it's so cold but yeah this is it. So now we are going to go snowshoeing. I loved how many activities there were to do just at Northern Lights Ranch. You really could just stay all day and have plenty of things to see and experience. This was our first time snowshoeing and it was so fun. It was so cool how the shoes allowed you to walk on top of really soft and deep snow without sinking into it. And it was so still and peaceful and quiet in the forest. You could hear the snow crunching beneath our feet and the birds in the trees. And it was so serene and lovely. The word we kept using to describe the scenery was otherworldly. It really just didn't look real. Like even though we had been in the snow for multiple days at this point, I never grew tired of our surroundings. I was constantly stopping to take photos of the snow on the trees because it was all so beautiful. I've seen snow many times before, but I have never in my life seen anything like this. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Is it very frozen? Yeah, up there it is. <laughs> it wasn't even wet. I don't understand. Wait, look at your eyebrows and eyelashes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's so cool. Wow, that's crazy. 
The true test of a man is if he can endure all the elements and still keep up his natural pace. <laughs> Poor John, this is getting ridiculous. Snowshoeing was so fun. It's already getting pretty dark. It's like 1.30 in the afternoon, but it's very cloudy. The sun starts going down around like two or three, but it's a little darker today because it's supposed to snow later. So it's a little bit overcast, but we're gonna go now and feed the baby reindeer. This is how I get around here at Northern Lights Ranch. My little <laughs> toboggan driver. Wait, will you get the snow out of that? <laughs> All right, T. Here we go. Hey. <laughs> you have to stop and get reindeer food first. And then they have all this free reindeer food for us to get right in here. Do we just take the bowl? Ugh. I think the bowl is for us to take. One bowl of reindeer food. What'd they say it was yesterday? Lichen? Yeah, something like that. Lichen. This is lichen, and this is what reindeer eat, not carrots. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Why didn't you just... We went a little too fast. <laughs> Hello, little reindeer. Oh my gosh, can I have some? Hello, where'd your other antler go? Look at their teeny tiny antlers. <laughs> Northern Lights Ranch also has a cute little outdoor ice rink, so we said goodbye to our reindeer friends and did some skating, and we had the whole rink to ourselves, which was so nice. It was kind of crazy the whole time we were here, even though every cabin was fully booked out, we did not see other people our entire visit. It felt like we were the only people on the property and just felt very private and secluded, and it was so, so nice. And then after skating, we went and warmed up by the fire and roasted sausages. And this is what we did for lunch and dinner almost every day here in Lapland. These were my absolute favorite nights. We would sit cozied up in the warmth of the fire and talk about life and drink cider. And then we would have s'mores for dessert. And we did so many amazing things on this trip. But our times snuggled up by this little fire are some of my most treasured memories. Here's our first gingerbread chocolate taste test. So good, so good. just got back inside from our little ice skating and s'mores adventure. It was so fun. Those are honestly like my favorite nights of this trip. So it is currently 3.30 p.m. Let me show you how dark it is outside. I feel like I've shown this in every video, but even though we've been here for like five days, it is still mind-boggling to me that it gets this dark at 3 in the afternoon. This is just right outside. It's pitch dark black right now pitch black you gonna turn the lights off i don't think they'll be able to see yeah it's just so black outside so we are cozying up and in about 30 minutes we booked our first sauna experience so we are very excited about that so we're just gonna chill maybe read a little bit or just snuggle up play some games or something and then head to the sauna hey 
We are on our way to the sauna and it's snowy. Can you guys see the snow? So magical. <gasps> wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Do you want to take a seat? <laughs> So I think this is like the traditional Finnish hot tub and then this is just like a classic hot tub. Oh, so that's nice. That's hot as well? Yeah. This one? I think so. Maybe that's the cold plunge. But wow, I can't wait to go in the hot tub while the snow falls all around us. Is this the sauna? favorite moment is here. I've been waiting for this. You always see it in the movies and it looks so satisfying. This is my Lorelei Gilmore moment. Brushing snow off the car. So fun. Wow. It's, it's honestly as fun as I thought it would be. <laughs> Hello, it is almost 7 p.m. The hot tub and sauna was so, so fun. That was, it was like a little pricey, so we were kind of like, should we, is it worth it? But I'm so happy we did. It was just such a good time. So nice that everything was private too. And Joey went in the plunge pool, the cold plunge pool for over three minutes. Three uh -huh. minutes because I necessarily wanted to. We made like a, a wager, you know? I, could, oh, I, I bet, bet him I, two minutes and 30 seconds that and, he couldn't uh, do it. And so she kept giving me a time update and little did I know she was fibbing the whole <gasps> time. Yeah, even he had already passed two minutes and 30 seconds, but I was like, oh, you're at two minutes, keep going. And so he kept going to three minutes and 30 seconds, but I just wanted to prove to him that he was capable of more than he knew. Yet she takes like she touched it like with just her <laughs> finger and she's like, nope. So. Yeah, no, that is not for me. I love I I hate cold water more than anything in this world, truly. So I dipped my toe in and then I was just like, 
I'm okay to go my whole life without this experience, but happy that Joey got to experience it. So now we're just driving into town. We're gonna go kind of near where Levy Ski Resort is. It's like an 18 minute drive from here. The snow is coming down and we are going to go sledding and get some pizza. Try to go off this one and get some air. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell. You guys, my braids, they were slightly wet still from the um, hot tub. Look at this. They are frozen solid, like literally frozen solid. <laughs> Feel this at the end, it's like crunch. Sledding was so fun, so, so fun. So fun. Yes. But now we're home and warm and very sleepy. So excited, probably gonna put on a movie. We were starting to watch The Holiday last night, but this guy fell asleep. So probably gonna put The Holiday back on and he'll fall asleep in like 10 minutes. But before I close out this video, I forgot to tell you guys. So this is the Northern Lights Ranch. Obviously we came here cause it's super cool, but we also wanted to see the Northern Lights really, really bad. It's like been a bucket list item for a while. Our first night that we checked in, we checked in technically two days ago. And on our first night we get here and the um, lady at reception is like, did you guys just see the Northern Lights? And we were like, uh, no. And I already told this story in um, my other Lapland vlog, but so if you if you already saw that, then you know. But if you didn't, then she was like, yeah, they were here 20 minutes ago. So we missed them by 20 minutes. And then Northern Lights Ranch has this app. You pay $9 and basically it alerts you if the lights are like in the sky. They have cameras all around. And we were like, that's kind of is it worth the money? Is it actually gonna, you know, the forecast for them was really low for all four days that we're here. But we bought it anyways. Fall asleep that night at like 9, right? 9.30, pretty, like pretty early because we were so tired. At 11, like 11.30, our alarm is going off. Joey's like shaking me awake and he's like, it's the Northern Lights, it's the Northern Lights. And so I look outside this little window and see the northern lights and so we're like stumbling out of bed half asleep into the snow it was negative six degrees in our pajamas my hair was still wet because i had taken a shower my hair when we came back in my whole head was frozen like my hair was completely frozen solid worth it but it was amazing it was so cool so so cool so we literally saw them within like six hours of being here and i'm going to put that footage here no way 